Library with another adult craft of the month project that you can make at home. Today we're going to make painted rocks. Here's what you need to get started. Step one is to choose a design for your rock. Now sometimes if you're walking and you pick up a rock and you see the shape you think, oh, this would make a perfect such and such, kind of like when you look at the clouds and you see shapes. Other times you need some inspiration. So I checked out these three books from Morley Library to give me some ideas of what to do. We also have some available in our digital collection. If you would like to go that route, maybe you're not comfortable with coming out yet, we do have some available in either Hoopla, Overdrive, or Libby. Okay, step two, now that we've chosen our design, we're going to pencil it onto the rock so that we know where we're going to paint our fish designs. Now I had dark black river rocks like this, which are a little harder to paint colors on. So I did a light white wash of this little chalk paint that I had left over from another project. If you don't have it, it's okay. Um, the acrylic paints in the marker should uh, paint onto the river rock. All right, so I'm going to do a little fish design. So I'm just gonna draw my fish now that my rock is dry. My little bottom fin here. And I know it's a little hard to see, but we don't really want it to shine through the paint. So that's okay. Oh, eyeball. Give him a little mouth. A little thin design here. This area I'm going to make black so that it looks like there's a tail fin. So I'm just going to make some marks for myself so I know these areas are going to be black. And I am ready to paint. Step three is to paint your rock. So I'm going to start painting my design on. All right, step four is optional. If you would like to purchase Mod Podge for outdoor use, uh, this will seal your designs on your rocks and you'll be able to put them outside or in a flower pot or something like that and they won't be damaged by water. I hope you try this project. It's fun for the whole family and you might surprise yourself with the results of your creativity. If you're looking for a challenge, I recommend trying a design from this book. Uh, it can be very difficult, but also very rewarding. I am very proud of my little toucan. If I do say so myself, it's very cute. Thank you for joining me. I hope you check out our book list for some inspirational ideas. 
Uh, if you would like to reserve a kit, we do have some available. You can call us at Adult and Teen Services, 440-352-3383, extension 300. Uh, supplies are limited, so act fast. Uh, thank you for joining me again. My name is Renee with Morley Library Adult Craft of the Month. Have a great day and happy crafting.